turn this music down. YouTube be tripping, it gets downright silly. But anyways, yeah, it is about 12.40. I've got about 20 minutes to get to my MRI. I have done more things. Y'all, I have done like more things in four hours than most, most people do in eight hours. I'm serious. But anyways, I'm getting ready to go and have my MRI done. Boy, uh, boy, uh, Lord, Lord. <laughs> Oh, finally home, guys. <sighs> it is 318. Lord Jesus, I did a lot, a lot, a lot today. Crazy. But, um, yeah, so hopefully I'll be getting some good news soon that I'll be able to share with you guys. And, um, yeah, I'm about to lay down because I, I had my MRI. My MRI was pretty rough for me, y'all. Um, yeah, it was pretty rough. I have anxiety disorder or whatever. Panic attacks. And, um, which y'all, I think y'all already know that. So yeah, I got used to that, and I got used to, you know, having to do CAT scans and all that. Well, since it's been a minute, for some reason in my mind, I was thinking that the MRI was going to be a CAT scan. So they asked if I have claustrophobia or, you know, anxiety, and I always check yes. But when he put me in, in case y'all don't know, like the the MRI no the CAT scan is the one where it's like it's your head like especially since they're what they're doing is they're looking at my spine so like part my head will be out like you know I won't be closed completely in the MRI is like is being put into a capsule and so for some reason I just had in my mind that it was a cat scan so I was like oh yeah I'll be fine he put my legs what the hell is going on on TV he put my legs up you know um, with pillows and stuff because I can't lay completely flat on my back and um, so he started putting me in there gave me the little things for my ears put me in there man as soon as that capsule went around me I started balling I just broke down crying yo like <laughs> for bruh. real bruh like I just wasn't expecting it you know I think that's why I broke down like that like I wasn't expecting it normally I like I try to keep my eyes closed when I've had it in the past so the guy stopped he was like are you okay and I mean I was like for real crying like not just like little crocodile tears coming down I was for real crying and I told him yes I'll be okay and so I, I closed my eyes and I calmed myself the hell down <sighs> that was issue number one <laughs> that should we just talking about the MRI okay Speaking of that, I gotta put all my necklaces and stuff back on. But anyways, so then, of course, since I have a lot of hardware in my spine, he was like, "Let me know if you start getting a tingling or if it gets hot or whatever." Y'all, I felt like a stinging not a fucking tingling okay a stinging going all the way down my spine to the right of my spine and I pushed the button and I told him he was like okay he said as long as it's not hot as long as it doesn't you don't start feeling hot and your back is not hot we're okay if you start getting hot then that's a problem but anyways I said okay I was just 
just been a little concerned lately. I've expressed that to y'all. Like the other day on the vlog, when I came out of my apartment, I was like telling y'all I felt crazy. And then I was like, don't don't think what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking. Y'all remember that? I was feeling dizzy. I had not had any dizzy spells or anything since before my surgeries. So, and the headaches. I was having some headaches every day. And it was like, I don't have headaches. I don't get headaches. Y'all not going to hear me complaining of headaches. Like... So some of these symptoms are starting to remind me of before I had my surgeries. They haven't been major. Like I haven't had a headache in a few days. And knock on wood. Okay. Um, you know, or anything like that. So uh, the dizzy spells, it's been like maybe twice, you know, twice I've noticed that. But I hope that it's not something that's going to increase, you know, or something that's just starting. Um, it just has me a little aware. I'm aware. And it has me a little concerned because I'm supposed to be moving forward. Forward, not backwards. And in a way, I'm starting to feel like I'm moving backwards health-wise. Hey guys, I am getting ready to go and have my nails and my eyebrows done. Look how hideous my eyebrows look. Can y'all see in this light? Right down here. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> no, darling, not me. Alright, and um, I'm not sure what color I want my nails this time but um it's hot as hell outside y'all so I'm about to get up out of here I'm so excited I got my apartment hey mom uh-huh I got my apartment Yay, I'm happy for I you. know I'm so happy oh, oh my god good. <laughs> yes. Okay, so when will you move in? The move in date is not till the 26th, though. The 26th, okay. Yeah. Well, you got your apartment. I know, I'm so excited. I, that search is That's over. <laughs> How are you feeling today? Oh, I'm feeling all right. I'm just uh, moving around. I'm about to go and get my nails done. Don't move around too much because, you know, we're going to pull out of here in the morning. Um, I thought we were leaving Saturday morning. Today's Friday, Buster. No, it's not, Mom. Today is Friday. Are you serious? I'm very serious. How come whoever I was asking yesterday if it was Wednesday, they said it was Wednesday? I don't know the, the folks you talk to that don't know Thursday from Wednesday, but this today <laughs> is Friday. <laughs> wow. <laughs> uh, okay. And tell, what's his name? I'm going to come in there and get my nails of uh, my uh, color change. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. All right. Give me. Okay, then. Okay. But don't do too much because, you know, I want you to be uh, okay when we get on that road. Yay, y'all. I got my apartment. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I don't have to search any longer. Yes. I'm excited. All right, let me get my music going. Let me get over here and get my nails done. Go by the apartment complex, sign some things, go by Target, you know. Yeah. I am in Target and I'm actually trying to find a mirror that you can put up in your shower. I've heard, I've heard that they have them here. Yes. Okay, this is probably the aisle. Let's see. Compact. Hmm. Let's see. 
Oh, this, this might be it. Because it has these little suction thingies on the back. I can't see nothing in there. Alright y'all, I'm at the um at the Starbucks inside of Target. Thank you. you I'll um, right after you. Okay, thanks. I'm getting ready to try this. It is a strawberry shortcake frappuccino. But why do they have to like show you the calories, right? Like I didn't want to know that the grande is 410 calories. <laughs> But anyways, I'm not really all that happy because I just realized that I don't have my debit card. I have no idea where it's at. But I think the last time I had it was at the bank yesterday. So instead of going to get my nails done, we're about to head to the bank first. That my drink is 410 calories. I can't have a piece of cake. <laughs> I mean, it looks good too, y'all. Yummy. Get that. Is the lemon cake, is it, um, is it soft? Yeah. Oh, I should have some of that. All right, y'all. I'm going to, um, I'm going to be bad. I found out I got my apartment, so we're going to celebrate by putting on a bunch of calories. All right? All right. <laughs>